Well, that cold weather out there might be reminding you of polar bear plunge season. We are just a few months away from jumping into the Chesapeake Bay, all to benefit the Maryland Special Olympics. And joining us live this morning to talk all about that is President and CEO of Special Olympics, Jim Schmutz. Good morning. Good morning, Jen. How are you? It's great to be on with you this morning, especially as the weather is getting cooler and plunge season is on the horizon for us. Absolutely. I've already started reaching out to potential donors for the plunge because this is going to be a big, big year and we get to do it in person this year. Yeah, it's awesome. We're excited. Um, as you as you noted, we, we're, we're going to be back at the beach. All plans are really uh, positive going forward. We had a safety meeting last week. We're certainly sensitive to COVID and, and protocols, and we're working to make sure that everybody who comes out to the park to plunge uh, has a great experience and feels comfortable in so doing. But the other thing is we're going to continue the ability to plunge your way. So for people who don't want to come to the to the park, the virtual plunge that we introduced last year is, is alive, well, and kicking. So plungemd.com for, for more information on uh, how to sign up. Yeah, that's certainly a great way to get people involved who don't like jumping into the cold water. But for those who do, what's going to be different this year? Well, so as, as most plungers know, we typically go the, the weekend between the conference championships for the uh, National Football League and the Super Bowl. And because of the extra week uh, this year, we will actually be moving to February 5th for the Maryland plunge. We'll have our cool schools plunge on the third, police plunge and corporate plunge on the fourth. So all those businesses out there that are looking for a team building opportunity, great way to get your teams together all for a great cause. Come out on Friday afternoon, sign your team up. Um, and then on the fifth, you know, we're looking forward to having everybody in the water and the weekend prior to that, you will be super plunging. I will be super plunging. It's going to be my retirement super plunge though. So any, and I want to make it a big plunge. So the most donations I can get ever, I'm hoping to get this year for that. So, but I'll still plunge for you every other year, just not the 24 uh, plunges. hundred percent, but this is the official announcement. And we, we want to get, we want to back Jen Franciotti and have this be a career year for her in fundraising. So everybody out there who is a Jen Franciotti fan, go to her, her Super Plunge page and support her. Absolutely. I've got all kinds of fun ideas planned for this year's Super Plunge too, but it's all about the athletes. It's it's why we do it every year, Jim. It is, you know, and, and I, I've got this thank you sign behind me because the support that the community has has engendered upon our athletes through this pandemic has been incredible. And we're just actually wrapping up our fall season. We had um, our fall sports championships up at Mount St. Mary's on October 16th. Last weekend, we had our state soccer tournament. Today, I'm, I'm going to go to two regional bowling tournaments, and we've got our championships the first weekend in December. And we're, we're actually trending pretty positive in terms of our athletes coming back to compete about 70% level compared to pre-pandemic, which is good in terms of just people getting a feel for it. And we actually do have some protocols in place. Again, obviously the health and safety of our athletes is paramount to making sure that they're they're comfortable and, and that we give them the best experience uh, possible. But I can't say enough about the volunteers and the community at large, both with the human resource and financial support. It's been tremendous. And just that ability to be back together again. I mean, we've all learned so much during the pandemic about how important personal relationships really truly are. It's going to be so emotional. Where can people sign up? Plungemd.com and it's it's either join a team or form a team. It is a it is a fraternal type experience. Uh, you know, people who know one another have can have a great experience. And as I said, you know, you can if if you're not comfortable coming out to the park or you're far so far away that you you don't want to make that drive. You can create your own plunge, do plunge your way uh, in a venue of your choice, and and we can help you out. And Jen, we are going to have a plunger of the year. So those videos that we we uh, um, really promoted last year, yes. we're going to have that. And at the end of the, of the season, we're going to do a plunger of the year bracket. That is fantastic. That means if you're watching us in Australia, plunge there too. You could win. 100%. We will take plungers from anywhere for sure. Fantastic. Jim, thanks for joining us. I really appreciate it. Can't wait till we can kick all of this off. Yeah, we're excited too. And again, thanks, Jen, to you and WBAL for your continued partnership. It, it really is a demonstration of your commitment to the community, to our athletes, and to the mission. Always. I love you and we love you. All right. Have a great rest of your day and go Ravens. Go Ravens. All right. Thank you.